as you was talking about it, um, I was like, ah, oh, this this sounds like technology that's doing what like Qigong or Reiki, or you mentioned a practice Same, which I haven't heard before we could get into that. It sounds like this having technology that does essentially what these practices do, which is channel energy from some source somewhere and bring it into the body. And mm-hmm. and that's that's really quite interesting. And it's sort of I don't think it'd be it, it, it is similar. Yes. Yeah, right. In um, that sense, it's similar. I believe it's a lot more powerful though. So do you think why would you say it's more powerful, do you think? Because I'm seeing miracles. I, I'm seeing miracles. I'm hearing about miracles, you know, children uh with learning disabilities are like being healed um we had a woman with a fatty tumor in her um i think it was her pretty sure it was her stomach area she was in the system maybe six hours gone they couldn't find it when she went to the doctor gone my one of my office staff um wasn't even in our large room but we get the healing energy in our office area So just working in the office for 15 hours, she texted me on a Sunday and she said, oh my God, the cyst under my arm is gone. I couldn't find it. She wasn't even in the large room where the technology was. So, you know, and, and there's more, you know, we, there, there's more, but uh, testimonies is what I'm saying. I know I've done Reiki as a client. I've done Qigong, I've done rolfing, I've done um, shaman work, all as a client. I've done every modality there is. I've done same as a client. Um, again, I think I was um, in this on this earth this lifetime to be a healer, and so I've explored every healing thing there is. Um, and even even the same way that I do, we don't we don't get the results. We don't get the results that this technology is giving people. And all they have to do is lay there and rest. Yeah, that sounds, uh, sounds very impressive because from, yeah, from my experience of going to healers and, you know, there's been very few that are actually really good. And there's only been one that I've actually spoken to who give me a story similar to yours of being able to treat cancer. But that took a lot of energy for this woman, you know, it was over weeks and it was a, it's a lot for this woman to do that. And I imagine uh, with things like Reiki and Qigong, it's like how clear of a vessel and a channel and how good is the healer, what's their intention. So there's there's definitely benefit from the most that these modalities, but you know, with technology, it could be a lot more consistent. If you can find the right technology that's, you know, created in the right way, using the right technology uh, energies, then the only the limit is the electricity that it's got to get plugged into, right? So mm-hmm. it would be consistent. It would always be this same energy and uh, uh a lot of people in the spiritual you know circles are sort of well some people are scared of technology they're worried that oh, it's only could be used for evil it's a control system the screens this and that but mm-hmm. actually if it's used at its highest potential it, it's here to alleviate suffering it's here to make life easier it should be utilized to its maximum capacity so it's very very interesting what you're talking about